Hello everybody and thank you so much for tuning in in today's video. This is just going to be a kind of what I've been loving the last couple of months video. Everything from hair care to beauty, makeup, and skincare. So let's get started. The first product that I've been loving that I've been using now for several months, um, pretty much every day, is the Petra Pixie by Petra Volumizing Mascara. Now this mascara is really really good. I mean you can get Petra Pixie by Petra now in the drugstores. Um, I don't know overseas but I know in the US you can absolutely get um, Pixie Beauty um, in your local grocery or sorry your local, your local drugstore. Um, this is the Large Lash Mascara and you can see the spoolie is a fir tree brush and it just maximizes just gives you tons of volume and tons of length as well. Um, it's a nice black color. It doesn't typically smudge unless, um, however, I've only worn it when it's been in a kind of cool out. So if it's like a hot, sweaty day or if you're going to wear it while you're working out, um, I haven't put it to the test in, the, in that way. Uh, it isn't a waterproof or water resistant mascara, so it's definitely going to run if it comes in contact with any any water. Um, but I have to say, it definitely does what it says it's doing. It volumizes as well as it gives a lot of length. So um, I am wearing it now. I'm just wearing a, a fairly light coat on the top and bottom lashes, and um, I absolutely love it. So this this one was 18, I think. It's either 16 or 18 the price point, but um, you know, it's a little on the higher side for a product being in a drugstore, I would say. Um, but it's it's a very good mascara. So compared to even the the ones that are a higher price point that I don't think do as well a job, um, the Pixie Pet by Petra definitely does. So. The next makeup product is the Physicians Formula. This eyeshadow palette I've had for a year now and um, I just constantly use it. You can see this one is the Shimmery palette and um, it's a neutral color tone and um, uh, this is definitely, definitely shimmery and glittery. So I wanted something just so I could wear on just a bare eye, just a single wash of color. I could just throw this on and it just kind of brighten everything up and dress up my eye a little bit um, without too much effort. So um, it does come with a little brush. I actually just usually just use my finger. I use my ring finger um, or to apply the eyeshadow. And um, I'll usually just do a single wash of color. Um, I am wearing this color here, which is the lightest, just on the lid. And um, that is it. The next product is nail polish. So I've been really into nails lately. I don't know what it is. I never used to be, although I'm not wearing anything now. But um, uh, there are two brands that I've been kind of just kind of alternating back and forth. And the first one is the Karma Hughes. And I've mentioned this in past social media um, posts before Instagram, and I think I've mentioned this in a past video, but Karma Hughes is a great um, nail polish, and it's, it's I think, seven free uh, as far as chemicals go, um, so it's a cleaner nail polish. Um, it's great for kids as well, because it's more of a non-toxic polish. The top coat and base coat, I have to say, is probably one of my favorite top coat base coats um, of the natural lines when it comes to nail polish. It just leaves like a almost like a gel finish and um, it's just, just fantastic. So I love the base and top coat. I'm almost out of it. Um, and I always just put it on top of um, any color polish that I'm, I'm wearing that, at that time. Even if it's a different brand, I'll put this top coat on any over any brand. Um, there's also this one, which is May Blossoms which is like a really pretty, I don't know if you can see it, it's a really pretty pale pink. Um, and then I'm loving the dark brown tones, um, the burgundies, the browns. Um, so that's Karma Hughes. Uh, there's another line that um, I just recently kind of tested out. I wasn't necessarily sure if I was gonna like it or not, but I really do, and I'll tell you why. It's the Mineral Fusion, I'll give you a better color. Um, this is like a shimmery gold, that's uh, called uh, 
pretty penny, this one. It's a shimmery gold or metallic-y gold, um, but it's the Mineral Fusion line, and Mineral Fusion's been around for a very long time, especially when it comes to more of a, like a cleaner, greener, natural brand of um, cosmetic. And uh, what's, what I love about this is it doesn't um, streak when you put it on. You could put one coat on and it just, it's perfectly even. And you, I would put a, probably a second coat on too, just to give it like a thicker, fuller, um, like richer finish. Um, but it dries fast and it doesn't streak. So that's one thing I love about it. And unfortunately, Karma Hughes does kind of streak, um, especially their lighter colors. So it's like you have to put at least at least three to four coats, I would say. Um, uh, of the Karma Hughes, unless maybe I'm just not doing something right, but um, it tends to be just like a little thinner when you apply the Karma Hughes versus the Mineral Fusion, which is just a full, um, just color wash, it's just a full wash of color when you first put on that first coat, so it doesn't streak, um, and it just is just completely even. So the brush is great too uh, for the application, and um, I'm really loving this brand. So this is a pretty like midnight, uh, blue shimmery gold. It's called Galaxy. Um, I haven't tried this one yet, but um, I will soon wear this. And then there's another color. This one's the Vintage Pearl, which is just like a more taupey kind of uh, neutral tone. So I love these. These are really great. Another product that I've just recently kind of gotten back into after not really wearing it for a very long time is Liquid eyeliner. So I did a little splurge and I normally don't buy makeup at Sephora um, just because I used to work for them and so I, I just the thought of buying something from Sephora when I used to get so much free makeup from them is just just something I, I'm not ready to do at this point right now um, but I did get the travel size liquid tattoo liner from the Kat Von D brand, um, and this is the Trooper, it's the just the cult classic favorite Trooper, um, it's the liquid eyeliner pen, and um, this guy just really stays put, you know, all day long compared to some of the more inexpensive lines, um, especially the ones in the drugstore, um, like, you know, just some of them just, either they start to pill and they cr like kind of come off, or they crack, um, uh, or they'll just come off with like if you're oily or if um, with water if you've been tearing but this is um, really does stay on um, I maybe have when I used to work at Sephora there was maybe a couple cases where people said that it just didn't stay on for them um, but you're gonna get that from time to time like not every makeup product is going to satisfy I think every single person but um, this is the Kat Von D liner, and I, I would say that it does stay on. So I did a, like a little uh, wing eyeliner the other day, and I just looked so good. I really loved it. And um, this is the travel size. This goes for I think ten or twelve dollars. Um, but um, there's also the full size one as well, so you can get that. Another product that I have to give like a, a huge shout out to is the Nature Tint. So this is a um, permanent hair dye and um, this is along the lines of a cleaner hair dye um, and I've been using it now for over a year um, I don't dye my hair too often but the roots tend to get you know I need to do my roots now because um, the gray is coming in so that um, I wanted to find something that was going to be effective and I know some of the natural dyes hair dye is just just don't cover enough um, and uh, this one really does so this is like along the lines I mean this is actually even better than um, Garnier which I've used before and uh, I absolutely love this it lasts longer than Garnier I could do a product review if you guys are interested but um, I sometimes go back and forth between a dark brown a black um, even the one I used recently it's a uh, it was a chestnut brown so the brown families will color my hair dark enough. I have black hair, but even the ones in the brown family or the brown tones actually do like a dark enough job where it's gonna cover 
and look black. Um, so when I only do the roots, I'll go maybe halfway down when I color, but I only just co cover the roots. Um, I never just do the ends because I don't want to dry it out too much or damage my hair too much until I actually like will have start to have to, but I think just the roots for now for me, um, I just do that. So, and this will last me at least six months. Like I won't have to re-dye for at least six months. And I'll start to go a little gray and then I could even like extend it out to about eight months, nine months if I really want to. So this one is so good. This is the Nature Tint um, hair dye. So it's really great. A great skincare product that I have been using for over well over a year now, and I guess it's more than a couple of months, my favorite, but it's the um, Trader Joe's 100% organic, um, organic Argon Oil. This is 100% organic, it's just pure organic oil, and it's $5.99 at Trader Joe's, so um, it's right in their, like kind of their beauty, skincare, um, like household goods section and um, it's just so wonderful it absorbs fast into the skin doesn't leave it anything uh, an oily film on my skin it hydrates enough I you know sometimes I'll put a moisturizer over if it's if it still feels a little dry but it really is fantastic and it's only $5.99 I can't believe it and it's organic so this is the uh, Trader Joe's um, Argon Oil it's all organic and uh, it's so good, it's $5.99, so I don't know if you've tried it, but let me know if you have, if you liked it, and um, if there's any other products that you love from Trader Joe's, we can go on and on about Trader Joe's, but um, yeah. Another um, product by Petra by, Pixie by Petra is their, her eyeliners. These are the Endless Silky Eye Pens um, that you sharpen, but they stay on really, really well. And this is a moss green color, and I actually got this at Marshall, so it was only like $1.99. But they typically go for, I think, $15 or $16 in the drugstore, uh, retail value. Um, but um, they stay on so well, and they're so beautiful. So, And they just kind of glide on. It's not a dry pencil where you're rubbing. It just glides on easily, and it's very silky satiny. Um, the finish is... It's a satiny matte, I would say, and um, it's just really beautiful. So those are the, that's the eyeliner that I'm loving. I don't wear it all every day, but I do love wearing it from an occasion. So uh, when I feel like it, and there's lots of different colors, or you could just do your classic black or brown. One last product that I would love to mention, it's not really a product, but it's a accessory, is um, the scarves. I just love scarves, and I've been, I've been wearing them, not every day, but um, this is just like a, a standard size scarf that is, opens up like this, and then I just fold it in half, uh, triangular wise, and then I roll it, and then I just kind of wrap it around my neck and tie it, and it just looks so pretty with a, um, like a, a v-neck shirt or um, uh, just um, at blouse, um, it's just so beautiful and um, it very just adds that like little bit of that something, you know, that just that accessory that really just um, it's just very eye catching and, cl and classy and um, just really beautiful, I find. So, when it really can dress up um, any top that you're wearing or any dress, um, but it's just just a pretty scarf, and um, this was. $12, so scarves are like relatively inexpensive. It's a 100% cotton scarf, so it's um, really, really just comfortable to wear, and um, I absolutely love it. So those are my favorites for, I guess, the last couple of months, I would say, um, that I've been using regularly, and um, uh, I hope I, uh, that gave you some insight as far as like other products, some products that are out there, and um, yeah, so, so that is the video, and um, I'm going to wrap things up. Thank you guys for watching, and um, if you have any questions, please reach out to me, and I'll be so happy to um, contact you um, with any information you are looking for um, in regards to beauty products, skincare, makeup, whatever it is. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.